Let's get a check in with Carrie this morning and smoky skies ahead, I'm guessing. Yeah, we're going to have to watch out for that, especially in parts of the North Bay. And I know it's about time to wake the kids up, get them ready for school. And in San Francisco at drop off time, we're in the mid 50s. It's going to be cloudy, foggy, maybe even misting and drizzling, but starting to clear out around pickup time. Temperatures in the mid 60s, but a little bit smoky. Let's go through our near surface computer model and it shows where we are seeing the bright colors with the blues and the greens indicating a little bit more smoke coming in. If you're sensitive to the smoke, you're going to really notice this and you do need to limit your time outside. Although for much of the rest of the Bay Area, it's looking pretty good for today, especially for the South Bay Santa Clara Valley. Not yet seeing a lot of that smoke. And then here we are tomorrow afternoon in the North Bay. We should see some improvements as well as along the coast and much of the rest of the Bay Area. Notice all of the very thick plumes of smoke moving off towards the east. The Caldor fire still burning out of control at this point and really choking the skies over South Lake Tahoe. We may see it spreading into that area as those winds pick up this week. We do have an ocean breeze that's coming in from the west that brings in that natural air conditioning and we're like checking the calendar like what month is this? Yes, we're talking about highs in the mid 70s in the South Bay, low 80s in the Tri Valley as well as parts of the North Bay during the middle of the day. It's going to feel so nice and comfortable and then for tonight we're dropping back into the low 50s. It's nice to have this break because it's not going to last as we head toward the end of the week. High pressure builds. We're going to see our wind direction shift and instead of getting that wind coming in from the ocean, it's going to be more of a northerly wind that's going to heat up our inland temperatures as well as bring in more smoke that starts on Thursday and continues for the weekend. Let me show you a spot like Livermore. Our inland areas are going to be heating up, so we're going to be in the low 80s for the next few days. Then Thursday it starts to heat up. Friday and Saturday we have some upper 90s still hot on Sunday and then it gradually comes down by the beginning to middle of next week. So for our inland areas we are going to be on a warming trend after the middle of the week. We do still have a few more days to enjoy this nice weather with some of our valley temperatures reaching into the low to mid 80s and then the 90s will be here and then for San Francisco it's also going to warm up. We're going from low 60s today fog and drizzle to more sunshine although it may be a smoky sunshine with highs in the mid 70s by Friday.